Welcome back, my name is Mike. Uh, I'm gonna tell you about how to operate the, um, and how to like tune the engine, uh, and how the engine works, um, <clears throat> and what you need to know as far as how the engine works. So we're gonna get started. Um, so in my last video on the clutch, I talked about there was a certain thing that you needed to turn on to uh, see the um, RPM, and that is this thing right here. I don't know, uh, my, ow, got caught or something. Um, so this is this machine right here. So what you're gonna do to boot it up is you're gonna uh, actually just do this one. And it's gonna turn on, boot up, and then this is your RPM right here. And it'll show you your lap times, all that stuff. Uh, all of it's you know hooked up to sensors around the go-kart. Um, and to turn it off, you just press both of these buttons at the same time, it's turned off. Um, so this is your engine. It's a two-stroke um, engine. Um, and uh, it's just pretty, it's a two-stroke trade engine. Pretty easy, you got intake and outtake. Very, very uh, simple. Um, this is your ignition switch right here. Um, I don't know if you can, oh you can't see it. This is your ignition switch right here. You're going to want to flip it on to start the go-kart and, and flip it off to cancel to stop the go-kart. Uh, what it does is it controls the spark plug. Um, when you switch it on, it switches the current over to um, the spark plug and that's what ignites the spark, which ignites the fuel, which makes the engine go boom. Um, right here you have your air intake. Uh, goes through these two holes, goes through a filter, ends up here to the carburetor, which is this thing, and that's where the fuel gets mixed with the air. And so these um, fuel, like these little notches right here, are how you adjust how much fuel, like what the fuel to air mixture ratio is. Um, and that's just you're just gonna be able to calibrate that based off of. Um, how uh, like how much a person weighs and all that. You're gonna need to just calibrate based off that. Um, and you're just gonna need to start up the engine and just do it uh, trial and error style. Don't do the black one, because the black one is um, for major changes while the blue one is for minor changes. And you only wanna do it like quarter of a turn or something like that. Um, as far as the intake goes, um, I showed that in the previous video on how the fuel lines connected, um, and you know, of course, after that, you have um, the engine goes to the uh, exhaust, which uh, is held together by two springs and safety wire, um, and the exhaust is mounted here, and because it's got such a small uh, opening and it's only just a muffler. It's gonna be really loud, so that's why you guys have earplugs in the corner um, over here, um, up here. Right here. That, that's your uh, your earplugs in case it gets too loud. Um, it's been my shortest video so far. It's great. Oh, one more thing. This is the throttle right here. Um, it it basically you can calibrate it to however you want. I have it to where. Uh, when you, as soon as you move it, it opens up some, uh, the uh, air in the carburetor, and that's what allows um, the uh, the fuel to combust because it needs air to combust. Um, and in order to start up the go kart, you're going to need to fill up the clutch fluid, uh, and in, and the clutch fluid can last pretty long. Um, you don't need to refill it every day, maybe like every week. But you know, it, it, it's not a big deal. Um, with so what you're gonna want to do is you want to flip the switch on right here. You're gonna want to um, uh, put the gas tank in and put the gas line in. You're gonna want to um, put your foot on the gas, but just slightly. Like you don't want it all the way down like that. You want it to have like just just like this, just just a little bit. Um, and oh. Okay, so I'm coming over here to the starter. So the starter's right here. It's this long thing with this big battery. Um, 
you're going to want to connect the battery, obviously. And then when you press the button, this is going to spin really fast. Um, this notch right here is kind of like an Allen wrench type notch. It fits perfectly into this bearing down here near the clutch. So this bearing, this middle bearing right here. And when you turn that and you apply a little bit of pressure to the pedal and you let a little gas in, the spark plug is going to ignite because it'll go through its rotations. And you do that until the um, engine ignites and it starts going. And then at that point, you take the um, starter away from the, uh, uh, from the bearing and the engine should just do the rest itself. Uh, very self-explanatory. I could actually show you how, um, how to connect it, but I, I don't think you want to spend more time on that. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, have a good Grand Prix season.